Hi everyone, welcome back to I Enigma. I am going to do Capricorn from 8th to 14th of September. Let's see the messages for you, Sun, Moon, Rising and Venus. This is going to be a general reading, so take what error resonates and leave what does not resonate. For more accurate readings, reach out for personals on WhatsApp, Instagram and email. Details are given below. Also do white prayer based spells for your highest good. And also send out purely energized crystals. So reach out to me for the services. Check out feedbacks on Instagram, daily free horoscopes and monthly free horoscopes, other offers and updates. So do follow me on Instagram. Now let's see messages on Capricorn. The world. Three of Cups. Wow. We have the best layout right now. And then we have the Six of Pentacles and the Empress. You're going to be recognized for your work. There is some sort of a major recognition coming in for your work. And uh, you will have a big, big opportunity to showcase your talent, to showcase your skill on a bigger platform. I'm seeing your co-workers are really happy with you and you might get a major promotion because your boss has been looking at your work and is really appreciating for whatever you're doing okay and i'm seeing you being more established than before like there's some sort of a fame name also coming in your workplace and your company wherever you're working like there is um recognition that's coming in you're being recognized i'm also seeing uh, your work may also be known by people from outside your company or from outside your country also okay see you're feeling very very confident over your skills over your talents you're extremely proud of yourself and there is no looking back there's no stopping there's just movement forward movement however when it comes to your love life i'm definitely seeing someone that is coming from a long distance and I feel like there might be your mutual friends through mutual friends or friends of friends. They might reach out to you and they may offer you a job or they may offer you, you know, behind something they have to give you. Like they, they're coming towards you with an offer, but there's an agenda behind it. I feel like they think that you're someone that they would like to get to know on a regular basis like this person is very excited they they specially come from a long distance to meet you and to get to know you more so this person wants to you know um like i feel like this is someone that is at a higher level in their workplace and they recognize you as a personality overall and they're pretty impressed and they think that you're someone that they would like to get to know more so they want to ask you out, they want to date you, they want to take you out. Also, you seem to be very strong. You're also popular in your surroundings. They know much about you and uh, they feel like you're very strong and you speak your, you know, uh, mind and you walk the talk. So there's something about you that they feel that it's very genuine. So you have taken up this person, you have taken away this person's heart. Like somewhere I feel like they... Um, they feel tamed by you. This is someone that doesn't like to be, you know, in relationships. So they're more concerned about family. They're a very family-oriented person. They're more concerned about their career. They're very giving and chivalrous person. But with you, they feel like their heart is melting. And they feel like there's something that they feel um, they've never felt uh, before with anybody else. So there's your innocence mixed with your power. Okay. So this is like a magical start to your love life. You didn't expect this to happen, but this is something magical that's happening. So there's a completely magically changes happening in your love life. So you're right now manifesting the one that you've been always dreaming about, like the kind of a relationship or connection you wanted. It's coming for you. Like there's a lot of brightness that you're spreading and a lot of positive people that you're attracting. This is someone that is going to make all the efforts. You're not the one that's going to make efforts. They're going to go beyond your expectations to, you know, make you happy and make you theirs. So with this two of wands, I feel like this person is planning for, you know, either a proposal or they want to re really spend uh, 
you know, serious time with you. Like they really want to, you know, take you out and get to know you more on a deeper level. Like they think that there's something that they can, you know, expect in this connection. Like something can evolve in this. So uh, I feel like they're waiting for the right time to reach out to you and work things out with you and take you out and, you know, they just want to talk to you all the time. So this person, you're always on their mind and they're planning to visit you. Okay, you may have talked to them once and there has been might be three months of gap, three days of gap, who knows. But during that gap, they have been thinking about that first meeting. This person still thinks about the first meeting and they just cannot stop thinking about it. They miss you. They want to talk to you. They want to get deeper in this connection they want to evolve in this connection with you they think that this is going to work out something is confusing what is that okay uh, i feel like you don't know who this person is you this is uh, this will come to you as a surprise because maybe you met this person for a professional reason for a work related reason and when you figure out when you realize okay this person has started to feel something and it's deep and It'll come to you as a like kind of a you know surprise or a shock. I would say you'll be very amazed. This is gonna make you happy, but I feel like wherever you are, Capricorn, you feel extremely lucky for the kind of support and the people around you you're right now with. So things are really good in your life in general. Even when you're single, you're just enjoying everything. Is just good and happy and jolly around you so you're very joyful like a kid experiencing new people new things new relationships you know okay so there's a new beginning and i feel like you're just happy in your own energy you're feeling confident and blessed and blissful everything is going great you develop good real relationships with people with the four of pentacles and the justice you're someone that's more focused on their career. I feel like Capricorn, you might put this person on test and it won't be easy for this person to crack it because you have like kind of have your fair share of experience and you're someone that is very difficult to convince that this person does love you or wants you. So you may put this person on a series of tests and I feel this will be coming off as successful they will definitely pass this with flying colors and you'll be happy to know that this person is someone that you were actually looking for maybe this is a libra or a leo coming in but this is someone that finds joy in your company they feel good when they're around you when they're with you but stop it's going to take a lot of time for this person to convince you because you're like you're bored of the same thing happening to you and then nothing coming out in the end of the day you might be stubborn and you might come off as too guarded for this person as well. However, their love for you is going to be extremely spiritual. They will understand that you're someone that has high standards and they have to, you know, make extra efforts to get through this uh, barrier in order to be a part of your life. So they value this thing and they value you for the person you are, for how you're conducting this, all of these things. So Capricorn, right now I feel you might not trust this person initially, but eventually you're going to trust that this person actually is the one that really, really cares about you. Tell me more. Three of Swords the empress you have been heartbroken in the past there is an energy of you being totally involved with a person who never gave you true commitment i'm talking about truth in a commitment so this came to you as a shock because you never expected that things can definitely that someone could want you definitely want you okay and not put you in a game of you know uh, on and off and all, all of those things so this will come off to you as a surprise that yes there's someone that really thinks about marriage with you so i feel like after ending all the negativity from the past you're going to make this move towards them and accept their offer you probably get get married to this person queen of swords is the second time i'm seeing six of cups 
and then we have the devil. I'm seeing like you've had a bad experience in the past or there's someone from the past that might reach out to you that you'll be completely ending your, uh, you know, ending the chapter with. So yes, I'm seeing there's someone from the past also reaching out to you that has uh, still, that is still coming into your life for some, you know, ego boost or I would say like just to waste your time. So in the end of the day, I feel like you're going to completely cut the cords with that person and completely shut the door because you have someone around you that really cares for you and you accept that you have, you're going to be in a relationship. So things are happening to you, not so soon, but they're happening. Okay, this is happening. Pay attention to the red flag. I'm seeing there's possibility of the past person trying to reach out to you and showing you that they're the one which you will not be you know convinced with and you will try to break all the connection with them so your family is going to be super happy with you taking being able to take care of yourself it is time for you in this month of september to just love yourself and accept the situation the way it is don't stop move forward look forward you do have um a relationship coming in take time out it's very important for you to hang out more and take a break from your active routine like career routine like work routine and do something for yourself like taking care of your body some self-love exercises freedom so i feel like right now capricorn it's time for you to enjoy freedom and do whatever makes you feel you want to like makes you feel right some of you want to go out and have some time like uh, go out on a beach and just sit there and watch the sunset you know whatever is in your mind like you must take your time out for your you know for your happiness for your you know feeling good like you want to feel good by the book i feel the one that's coming into your life is someone that comes from your own society and your own religion power you instinctively know what is right for you and you have the power to say no or to walk away. See, I told you, you're going to walk away from something that didn't work out for you in the past because I feel like someone is trying to come back and reconcile with you. You're feeling much more in balance because you're able to take time out for yourself, for your self-care. And I'm also seeing you must be indulging yourself into creative activities while working. And you're also taking care of your body, yourself, your health which is very important. So you're balancing both the energies well. This brings happiness, confidence. I'm seeing you being much more happy. See, again, I was talking about the same thing. She started to balance both the sides, both the aspects of life. Okay, you're being practical at the same time. You're also taking care of yourself and you're feeling more spiritual and grounded at the same time. And then we have dance with life. So it's time for you to just go with the flow, do what you feel you like and not bother about how people judge this or how you will be, you know, seen, reach out. So definitely there's someone from the past is about to reach out to you, which you're going to completely shut the door on. Strategy. It's important for you to just have a proper planning about how you need to go in future and who you do not entertain in your future because setting strong boundaries, writing it down and memorizing it in your subconscious will help you lead a comfortable and balanced life, I feel. Let's see what else we have. Capricorn, please. Main female. Poverty, lovers, mature women. Okay, there is an involvement of an older woman in your situation in bringing you guys together. I feel like you're going to meet the one, but there's an uh, involvement of a mature woman that brings you to this person. Maybe she's in your neighborhood, maybe she's in your family. Okay, but there is a third person that's bringing you guys together, that's introducing you to your person i feel that is your soulmate with the lover's card you feel privileged because people around are really helping you in this time you might be feeling alone deficient with this past person not being there in your life okay let's see what are the signs that are coming forth for our capricorn in this week we have taurus coming in we have cancer coming in and we have one more 
yes again cancer very strongly see this is what i was telling you about it's time for you to take care of yourself which you're doing and your person okay or you have e and o in your name uh some of you are english uh into english like teaching english or something like that so major endings are happening in your life so that you can allow new person to come in take a vacation take a break very important family needs more of your attention i'm seeing like your energy is going to renew slowly and e i yeah i'm sensing some of you are very good in like i feel like you might be teaching or studying english as a subject for you as a field of study okay your person may have these letters in their name i'm seeing a beautiful uh proposal maybe with a flower coming in this person misses you maybe they've seen you once and they want to meet you again as person someone could be an official person they have their own uniform they work for the nation uh i feel like this person someone that is at a high rank in their job now i'm going to see from aries to pisces your person's feelings for you how they're going to be 8 to 14 of september let's see all right aries to pisces okay aries is feeling more in control of their emotions they right now do not want to deal with this taurus is wanting to talk to you because they have some questions in their mind and they are a little too stubborn here to understand what's going on but they do have feelings and then we have gemini is feeling heartbroken and wants time off cancer is also feels like a failure right now and with you coming in their life they are still feeling the same way but i feel like they will take time and this is someone from the past you have to release this cancer leo is afraid of opening up their heart to you because they think they're not good enough or you might reject them virgo wants to take it slow because they think that this can turn into something promising libra is playing mind games oh my gosh you have so many negatives around you and then we have scorpio wants to team up with you wants to help you be there for you and guide you and be uh, yeah have a relationship as well sagittarius thinks about love love and love that's it relationship and we have capricorn capricorn is highly attracted to how you carry yourself and you're always on their mind i feel like they're very attracted to maybe you sang a song in front of them or the, your voice is something that is stuck in their head so they think about you Aquarius feels burden i feel like they think that there's a lot that's going on in their life and they cannot take it anymore so there's something in their personal life that's not very good that they're trying to heal from okay and this is why they're on and off if they are Pisces is someone that thinks that this is uh, someone like Capricorn is someone that I'd like to invest my you know time and energy because i think that you are a pot potential match and that they can find you know uh, a partner in you so they might be thinking about stable long term connection with you so they want to get to know you more so this is coming very strongly towards you pisces so that is it guys i hope you enjoyed the read do not forget to subscribe and like the video to claim it and share it for more people to come in and uh, also hit the bell notification follow me on instagram and i will see you again